Good morning, family. Welcome to today's Lessons for Life. Today is Monday, June 7, 2010, and today we're reading Psalm 138. As always, I first encourage you to read these scriptures through for yourself. See so what you get from it. You can post your comments directly on our blog. Uh, but there's a verse in there that says that, uh, Though the Lord be high, yet he hath respect unto the lowly, but the proud he knoweth afar off. And what that means uh, to me, as I would uh, take it, is that even though the Lord... Um, well, it says that the Lord is high, but he respects those who, and when I see lowly, uh, he respects those that really humble themselves and submit themselves to him. But those who are proud is um, those who uh, really think that they can do it by themselves, that they're doing it all alone, that they um, don't want to submit and realize that you know nothing is done without him. He's the, the only power, really the only authority in our lives. So he respects those who really humble themselves, and those are the ones that he's there to help, and that he is uh, able to help. You know, if you if you sometimes there's people who uh, need help, but because they're so proud, they can't even get <laughs> they can't even get the help. So uh, this is what I got as I was reading this portion of this um, this song. Just for us to remember to um, be humble. Remember who we are and who we are in relationship with the Lord, and Remember that he's the one. It's really, you know, even though we may do some great things, we're never doing it by ourselves. But we're actually doing it by his power and by his grace and his mercy and, you know, by him working through us. So that way we can stay humble. We can stay, um, as it says, you know, lowly. Um, and this is how I take it, lowly. So you may have another understanding of it. So if that's, that is the case, you can, like I said, leave a comment on the blog. But uh, my lesson and what I will share today is for us to remember... Um, to be humble and to submit ourselves to the Lord, and um, that's that's who He respects. That's that's uh, how we can keep our relationship in in the right relationship with the Lord. So, with that, create yourself a wonderfully blessed day today, and we'll talk again tomorrow.